Hey, yo, this is Dash. Get ready. Hey yo, this is Dash, and I haven't done a garden update in quite a few weeks, but I figured I'm, yeah. It's Sunday morning, and I'll show you guys what's going on. So I'm at the front of the house, and we have a bit of a jungle up here. The cherry tomatoes, and you can see some of the cherry tomatoes down in there. They have completely taken over the entire front section of the house. Those are pumpkins up there, and they are running out towards the, obviously the front gate there. The, some of the herbs are still doing okay. This one, uh, I can't, oh, let's see. This is lemon balm. It is completely taken over. The sage still looks pretty darn amazing. Some of these herbs that were in here are getting overrun and they got trampled. The, the gas company had to install this thing and they were standing in this box so they trampled it. But it, it some of it came back. All right, so the herbs, some of these herbs, this is like peppermint and lemon balm and sweet mint. The raspberry bushes are looking okay. It, it, they're kind of sodden because it's been raining. Side of the house, the I don't know. Uh, I don't know what these are. I'm, I'm sorry. I still don't know. The potatoes in the box over here are looking decent for a change. The daggone deer. Every time, like these leaves, today is Sunday. They'll probably be gone by the end of the week. The deer keep eating the leaves off of the potato plant. And the potato plants are kind of folded in and rolled on themselves because the guy who comes to cut my grass, when he comes to cut the grass, he kind of picks these up and puts them back into the box, which is fine. But then that just makes it easier for the deer to eat. Now, coming all the way back to the buckets, the buckets did not do so hot because the deer, straight between the deer, look, between the deer and the squirrels, it killed these things. Now these two potato boxes, or potato buckets are still growing. We have an errant uh, jalapeno, and there's one here. Actually, I'm gonna take this off, because other than that, it won't last. And I did not realize that deer would eat everything. They ate everything. All of the potatoes, all of the potato leaves, all of the uh, zucchini, the squash leaves, and they also ate all of the jalapenos, the peppers, even the jalapenos off of the plant. So that's why I haven't been doing much of it up a of a, a garden update because the deer keep eating everything, and there hasn't been anything left for us. So anyway, there is your garden update. Thank you guys who have been asking about what's going on in the garden, how the bucket garden has turned out. Unfortunately, I'm going to probably have to build some sort of structure around it to keep the deer out and actually allow us to, to have a harvest. But, there's my thumbnail. Alright guys, thanks again. I'll see you next time. Hey look, guys, down below is listed the P.O. Box. If you want to send us something to try, a sauce, a seasoning, some jerky, feel free, something funny. Something for us to try. Send it to the P.O. box below. It's always listed in the description. But thank you for watching. If you haven't already, please do subscribe. Join us on Wednesday night at 9 p.m. Eastern. We go live for two hours. In the first hour, we talk about barbecue or something barbecue business related. The second hour, come as you please and bring your flesh. And we talk about anything. And then we talk about anything. All right. Well, not her, but me. So. Sometimes yeah. I pee. pee.
Yes, you do. So you want to tell them thank thank them again for watching. Thank you again for watching. And we'll see you. Oh, I'm sorry. And please do subscribe, and we'll see you next time. All right. Thank you Bye. guys.